For those of you who do not know, Six and Saskrawe Island is located on the south coast of Cambodia, bordered by Thailand in the northwest, Vietnam to the east, and Gulf of Thailand to the southwest. Our resort is located in Sianok province, Rim Commune, on a private island and spread over 12 hectares. To reach to our island, you can go to Phnom Penh, the capital city of Cambodia, which takes approximately 2.5 hours on expressway, or once we have an international flight operations, you can fly to Sianok Airport and get to our jetty in 10 minutes. From the mainland jetty to our resort, it's just a 10 minutes drive to get to our island. Our resort has 40 private pool villas with the different villa categories, with the beach retreat being our premium two bedroom villa that has a direct access to the ocean and the hideaway villa being our leading category. We have two restaurants and a sunset bar and a couple of destination dining options. We have a beautiful spa with seven treatment rooms, an alchemy bar, a meditation cave and an indoor and outdoor yoga studio. We have a sports center offering different experiences and a centrally located air club. One of our signature experience not to be missed during your visit at our resort is a sunset from our sea breeze walk. For those of you who've been to Cambodia and to our resort, you may have heard the word bong. Bong is a widely used word at our resort and in Cambodia, uh, which is a sign of respect in Khmer culture. So please allow me to introduce to our bongs. Bong Christian. Bong Lida. Bong Liliana. Bong Jack. Bong Rish. Bong Sina. Bong Pui. Bong Dima. Bong Saran. Bong Rani, Bong Tat, Bong Dan. At Six Nights of Scrap Bay, the priority of all of us has always been for host growth and development. Um, we try and get in hosts that has little or no experience here at the resort so that we can train them and groom them in different areas. I've got many, many successful stories of hosts who started as a line host. They are now proudly representing a leader of the department. My name is Frankie. Five years ago, I was working at Two Cents at Ninvan Bay as a training executive. And now I'm a markup manager at Two Cents at Scrap by Island. My name is Sina, the housekeeping manager. Thank you, Six Senses, for giving me the opportunity to grow and development. Let me quickly introduce you to some of our new experiences that we managed to put it together at the resort together with our host. I would like to start with an arrival ritual when the guest arrives at the resort with our host, where we offer a water to a Bodhi tree so that the guest can connect with our island environment. Um, upon arrival at our Khmer house, which is, a, which is our lobby, the welcome drink is prepared a la minute for our guests. As you enter our villa, there's a handcrafted welcome board, which is written by our Jan every day for our guests, which is very much appreciated. Every evening, there is as well a special turndown and handcrafted gifts for all our guests, depending on the purpose of visit at the island. Um, followed by, again, a departure ritual uh, where we have a connection with our local community in the pagoda where the rice is offered um, by our guests. Finally, when the guest actually sits on the boat for departure, our host flags out a departure banner, which is a part of our vision and value, which is fun and quirky. Now, culinary and food and beverage part, um, 
The new experiences that we have for our guests is um, house-made kombucha and shrub that's done in-house for our guests on daily breakfast. There's rocket fuel on rotation as well, where the guests can actually take the menus back home if they wish to. The new experiences that we've added at our spa is a sound healing experience, which is very popular amongst our guests. Um, the other one that is popular, which has been refined, is the traditional Khmer massage. We have biohacking amenities that we use at our spa for all our guests. At the Experience Center, um, we've recently purchased a floating retreat, um, which has been one of the most popular spot for guests to swim and dive in and out from there. We're also working on a jetty strengthening project, which is scheduled to complete by, by end of March 2024. And finally, our preventive maintenance on RO plant and wastewater treatment is as well ongoing. One of the projects we have recently finished is our organic farm, where we host 400 chickens, ducks, piglings, and our bee is currently busy preparing our honeycombs we will soon have at our breakfast buffet. So please come and visit us and enjoy Krabi Island.